Hey, what's up, all you awesome people in the X-Army, Chris here. And today I'm going to actually be showing you guys and probably many other people that have been having problems with their Minecraft accounts with their skins. So basically what I have been experiencing, if I go to Minecraft, oh, wrong one, <laughs> my bad, uh, come on. Stop. Uh, it's not responding. I'm uploading a video. I'm uploading my latest video at the same time, so it may lag a bit. Come on. There we go. Minecraft. There we go with Minecraft.net. Yes. I'm going to log in. I'm going to pause it right here so that you don't see the secret techniques. So we're back. Okay, and I'm back. So I logged in, and as you can see, I have my profile. Yeah, Bros. Norm normal Steve skin. Yeah, I have my where Minecraft editing. Yeah, blah blah. Where 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 skins? There we go. So uh, I have my skins right here, and let's pick. Let's say I know this one, my prison skin. If I do this and upload it, it's gonna. It's like, oh wait, oh wait, wait, that's one of those that I actually completed. Oops, my bad. Uh, where was the one that I had a problem with? I need to find one that is bigger than needed. Because more or less, most of them I already kind of edited. Uh, let's see, where did I put one that, let me try this. Let's see if it gives me there. Upload. Bingo, there we go. So, if you guys have this error problem, then there is a very, very fast, easy way to resolve it, which I have mastered, basically. All you have to do is go to, uh, what was it called? Just like my brain. I still have the headache, as I probably kind of said in my last video, but uh, let's see. New grounds, yes, in the, on new grounds, and you have to search for Minecraft skin. This like Minecraft skin. It should Minecraft skin editor in new grounds. Oh wait, now I remember what it is. It's a uh, skin craft. There we go. I, I, I just remembered it when I was like, wait, Minecraft skin. That's, that sounds so familiar. And then kabloosh, my brain just exploded and it's like, skin craft. So yeah, this is basically what, it's a free and it's perfect for everyone. So yeah, I've had uh, quite a lot of problems with another uh, one of these that I saw another video about and they and it only works on Chrome so this works on all browsers no matter what I have not found a browser yet that doesn't work so you can just import a skin you can uh, import choose file yeah let's go to my desktop my editing my skins and my skins so it was the potter Potter. I am planning on doing a Harry Potter series, but I'm not sure yet. So I just have all these skins because I was lazy, not doing anything else that day, and I just made a lot of skins. Anyways, uh, open this, load, and you, as you can see, it's it's cool. See this? Yeah. So you press go, and then you do export and save. Save as PNG file. My skin, you can just save it on desktop with blah 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 blah, blah like that. Skin craft free. You have to wait for this little ad, but uh, it's it's basically 20 seconds, and yeah, it's 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 just you're gonna have an ad here. I have ad blocker, so it's it's not really any weird things going on. So continue. See. Uh, import or just uh, upload the skin to Minecraft or net or just continue. I just go continue. 
and now I have this skin right here. You see this? They edited it and put it in the newest Minecraft skin version. And if you check the size also, it is, look at that, it's one, one, like two kilobytes. It basically took my skin and made it into a like seven times smaller format, more actually than seven times. And it's basically still the same skin. So now, no, this is the wrong one. I need this one. Okay. Now if I go back here, browse, and I take the one that I just created, open, and upload. It will allow me to upload as a skin. As you can see, this works for every skin. And the cool thing is that this thing, basically what it is, is a converter as well. It not only converts the old skin data into new skin data, but it also makes it smaller in size. Because I have, uh, uh, I tried using Photoshop and all that kind of stuff. And it just came out way too big, no matter what I did. Even that uh, window, uh, that paint thingy with, that allows you to edit and put blanks and everything like that. So, uh, yeah, now if I just start up my Minecraft, I have Razer Cortex, which is awesome. This is one of my favorite things because it optimizes everything that I love to do. And now, if I go in lane, I will have the skin. Let me show you guys. Because previously, I uploaded my prison skin. If you guys remember at the first, at the start of the video, and I wasn't, and I didn't do any cuts or anything like that in the video. So let's see, single player, my test world, play. Because double click doesn't want to work. And if I F5 it, oh my god, hail Gryffindor, hail Gryffindor, <laughs> anyways, so yeah, that's basically how to get your Minecraft skin up to date with all the, basically e everything you need, because this is basically the best, uh, like, skin editing software that I have found. It's free, it's on the internet, works on every browser, and it instantly converts any old skin into the new skin format. So I would say that is just beyond ridiculously awesome. So these dudes that created SkinCraft, just thumbs up, you're awesome. And yeah, so, uh, hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial video of how to change your skin into whatever you want, whenever you want, however you want, whatever you want, ever. And yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe to see more videos. And yeah, see you guys in my next video. Bye bye and stay awesome.